a helpless position para sa kanya. Ang ganda ng position ni Alan pero dahil sa stop niya, nakakuha ng jump shot sa kabila. Nalos pinawi naman kagad. Okay, si Ivan Ludovice, Saldua. Pump fake, pasa dito kay Custodio. Drives baseline, Custodio, nakaminor lang. Pasa dito kay Marky. Aatrasan si Alan Santos. Four seconds sa kanina shot clock. Marky, wala ang tira. Right on cue, Leo De Vera para sa rebound. Arboleda, De Vera, quick handoff. Pagunta rito kay Joseph Nalo. Slip, De Vera sumitsik sa ilalim. Corner, they swing it around. Arboleda para sa tres. Mintes. Ito ngayon ang Davao. Ludovice, nasa kanang bahagi ng ating floor. Stops at nadagit dito si Harold Arboleda ng foul. This is a good pickup para sa Davao. Ludovice, as we all know, I would say one of the top three players last season of using the pick and roll. Such, such a good pick and roll player. You know, he did well overall when he was his stint in Bataan. You know, first 10, 12 games he was with Pasay. When he was with Bataan, you know, the combination of him and Pamboy Raimundo was somewhat lethal in stretches. Mm -hmm. um, but this is a good pickup, especially for Bonbon bon Custodio, who we all know is a scorer. And I think Ludovice, with his ability to shoot, will give, eight, no? will give space more to Bonbon bon as he is a terrific one-on-one -on -one player. At saka hindi mapapagod si Bonbon bon magbaba ng bola the whole game dahil tatlo na silang magre-reliebo dyan. Si Terzo, si Bonbon, bon, at saka itong si Ludovice. Right. So ating talaan yun, 3-2-2. Ludovice, pinapagabag ni Nalos. Pasa dito kay Billy Robles. Ito dito kay Mark Yee. Ludovice. Ganda ng health defense dito ng Zamboanga. Outside shot! At nahulong para dito kay Billy Robles. May awa din talaga yung tira niya dun eh. Anytime you're patient on offense, especially after a pick and pop, that four guy is so critical. If you don't have a shot, you have to reverse the ball, which happened to Mark Key. Led to the dribble drive by Ludovice. And you talk about a guy that really performed in the finals. Si Longo Superman Rose. showed up. Bagay na bagay yung pangalan niya. Pili Ray talaga eh. Drop pass dito kay Nalos. Playing bigger than his size. Good turn pass ni Rafi Reyes. At Saldua, natapikan dito ni Joseph Nalos. Bola mananatili. Sa Davao. What was that? Game two, where Davao won. Robles had close to 20 rebounds. Mm. Diba? Sa Rizal Memorial Coliseum yeah. yun nilaro. Custodio. Pinapostihan si Rafi Reyes. Former teammates. Mm -hmm. Sa nagpamadali dito si Arboleda. Pasa, beaten. Wala yung tira ni Nalos. Karambola, nakakuha pa rin dito ng Zamboanga. Alan Santos, they want to swing the ball. Pasa dito sa low wing area kay Harold Arboleda. Marky ang nasa harapan niya. Naka shifting zone dito ang Davao. Nalos para sa tres. Mintes, good box out by Robles. Tapikan, last touch dito. Si Ivan Ludovice. Sa Buanga, even though they've not you know, hit the last two shots, it's really in a good flow in their offense. Lahat nakakahawak ng bola at hinahanap talaga nila Yung kaduluduluhan, yung pinakamagandang tira. At saka nakita mo, no, dahil dalawang team na to, medyo matagal na rin magkakasama. Kahit mga bago yung acquisition, veterano, hindi nagmamadali tumira. Inside out, De Vera open. Derechong, derecho Pasok na pasok, kasado at sigurado para doon sa three-point shot na yun. Itong si Leo De Vera. Lamang na dito ang Zamboanga ng dalawa. I can see a quality game ahead tonight with these two teams. The way they have been moving the ball offensively. Robles, another pull up. That's a push. Pero po, tulak. tulak dito kay Chester Saldua. Binanggit mo kanina, Coach Christian, mahilig sumiksik sa ilalim, mahilig tumalon kumuha ng offensive rebound. Yan ang kanyang naida, naibibigay dito ngayon sa opensa at depensa ng Davao Occidental Tigers. Well, lahat ng mga sinabi mo, that's exactly kung ano yung mga dapat niyang gawin and nothing more, nothing less. Especially with this experience and stacked double team led by Marky. Tres dito ni Ludovice, wala. At ang 
Bola babalik sa Zamboanga. Good stop there. And good box out, ha? Nakita mo, pinong-pino talaga mag-execute. Uh, Ngayon, ipasa muna natin kay Sheila. Meron siyang report tungkol sa Zamboanga. Sheila. Yes, Martin. Pinagdahandaan ng Zamboanga ang panibagong season kasama na dito. Ang pag-improve na kinalang short rotation. Last cup. Their additions are mostly fresh players from college because of you veterans making their lineup deeper. Adjustment at makuha ang sistema ang challenge para sa kapuna ni Coach Raymond dahil halos lahat ang bago. Ngayon, maging masipag at magkaroon ng teamwork ang kanilang goals sa larong ito. Balik sa inyo. Maraming salamat, Sheila. At sipag nga. Yan ang sinasabi mong kanilang puhunan. Yan natin ngayon kung uh, pabalik pa sila dito. Pero Ivan Ludovice, dere-derecho. Inainalintana yung depensang nasa harapan niya. No, Four-point swing, really. You know, that's a usual finish para kay Rafi Reyes. Missed it. Oh, what a shifting move. Ito si Ludovice, ang ganda. Mm -hmm. At Boleda, pasa dito in space mabunta kay Reyes. Pass and cut. They swing it around. Nalos. Nasa harapan niya si Ludovice. Good challenge. Going vertical. I beg to differ. Kaya buwag sakti na sinasin. So may konting sipa. May konting sipa. Parang, 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 parang nakita ko foul yun. So may timeout dito ngayon. Ang ating talaan. Dikit na dikit lang. Isang puntos ang labang ng Zamboanga. Contra sa Davao Occidental. Magbabalik po ang inyong Party Ka Pilipinas Basketball League. Warrior mode para dito kay Rafi Reyes. Naglaro para sa University of the East. Pero bago yan, naglaro muna para sa San Sebastian Staglitz na nalo ng ilang kampiyonato. Under Coach Raymond Valenzona. Kaya naman siya yung katalaga ex-pro na kinuha nila dito. Well, um, ang ganda na pick up aside from, you know, the connection na binanggit mo. You know, I'm looking at, kung makita ulit sila ng Batangas, you're looking at a defender kay Jeff Viernes. Mm -hmm. A capable defender. Not to say, that he's gonna stop Jeff. I think Jeff Viernes is an outstanding uh, guard. One-on-one -on -one player. One-on-one -on -one player, but Stat I think Gator. Rafi Reyes is capable, along with team defense, of limiting a guy like Jeff Viernes and the others. Tulad tonight, Ludovice, tough matchup as well. Bon Bon Custodio, nakita natin on the post, nahirapan sa kanya. Mm -hmm. Nalos. Wow. Pero nandudon si Eman Kahlo to get a stop hustling down. <laughs> Ay, tabi yung James Forrester, eh. Nagbibigay na. Ibang iba atletisism, eh. Di ba? Parang dalawa na sila ni Billy Robles ngayon na pwede mong asaan na humahasin. Nandun doon, Eman Kahlo, di naman yan magpapatalin na sa mga matitibay nilang manlalaro. Ganda rin na inilaro nito sa full season last year. Handoff, mabunta rito kay Gino Jumawa, si isa pang former son, Sebastian Staglip. Pull up, is Steven Kudhal. Meron siya niya, meron talaga siya niya. Malambot ang kamay din ito from that 15-foot line. Pero ang tikas ng katawan pagdating sa depensa. Mamasahihin ka talaga. Walk. Napachat siya dito. Sa uling penetration si Billy Robles. Lee, bobati tayo ng magandang gabi sa lahat ng nakatutok sa atin. And syempre, special mention kay Coach Chico Tan. Brother, pagaling ka. Experiencing a few health health scares, pero pati ba yan? Chino and Jacob, magandang gabi sa inyo boys. Enjoying the action here at good matchup. Pull up dito ni Leo De Vera, wala. From top of the key. Yeah, that time, may kamay sa harapan ng mukha niya. First two shots na pumasok, wala, libre-libre. Pull up dito mula sa labas ni Eman Calo, wala. Rebound ni Leo De Vera. Ryan Costello, they swing it around. Backdoor dito ni Jumawas, not a pick. Marky on the steal. Eman Calo, cross court pass to the streaking. Ivan Ludovice, and just finishing off the glass. So, 
Costello ngayon. Maganda rin ang inilaro nito during second half ng ating regular season para sa Marikina. After lumipat siya from Muntinlupa, Kudal, handoff kay Jumawas. Forrester na sa harapan niya. They swing it around. Costello para sa tres. Mintes. At may tulak dito si Steven Kudal. You have to appreciate, you know, yung execution ng bawat kuponan. Really getting quality looks, whether in the half court, na tulad nito. Ganda ng pasa. Could have been fouled right there by Ludovice. We've seen Ludovice dribble penetrate and then magkikrate para sa kasama niya. That time, he was the recipient. Siya naman ang tumapos. Ito ngayon si Ludovice. Siya nagbababa ng bola. Binabagabag dito. Ni Ryan Costello, familiar NCAA matchup to ha. Ludovice for San Beda, Costello, San Sebastian. Kaya very familiar din yan kay Coach Raymond Valenzona. Ito Mark Yee ng mama na sa ilalim pero hindi na-shoot yung finger roll niya. Reed Hontilia ngayon. Oh, sa pagtakbo, eh, Mancalo. Uh, uh, sportsmanlike. Natawagan ng yeah. unsportsmanlike foul. Tinamaan sa mukha. Itong si uh, Ryan Costello. Yeah, they're gonna review this. Lalo na medyo sa ibabaw ng balikan. Oh. Ito yung off the ball. Uh, replay natin. Off the ball. Nakaubang. Right so, there, yeah. So that, that, you know, that, that, that could be a uh, disqualifying foul oh, right there. Oh, over the shoulder. I think it should be a uh, disqualifying foul. Especially off the ball, like so we that. shall see. And Joseph Terzo set to come in, as well as Marco Balagtas. So, Eman Kalo ngayon, getting an unsportsmanlike foul. Unsportsmanlike foul on number 19, Eman Kalo. So it's an sportsman like foul. And uh, that was a uh, two free throws plus ball possession para dito kay uh, Ryan Costello. Starting the season last year with the Putin Group Akagers. Then we put the Marikina Shoe Masters. At ngayon, nandito na sa Zamboanga Family's Brand, Sardines. Talagang ganun eh, no, Coach Chris? At basketball, pagdating sa coaches, yung mga kilala niyang player, yung may relationship siya, dun siya talaga pumupunta. Tulad nito si Costello, nang galing sa programa ng San Sebastian. etong sila Jumawas, player niya ng high school. Talagang ganun, may comfort level eh, no? Right. Well, alam mo na kasi yung kapasidad eh. Uh, especially, you know, if the battles na you've been through with the history you have with each other, lalong-lalo nun, nung kabataan pa nung player. Formative years, eh, no? Alam mo na kung ano yung kapasidad, alam mo na kung ano yung ibibigay ng uh, player na yun sa'yo. Terzo, they swing it to Marco Balagtas. Marky ngayon, naganap na mapapasahan. Balagtas para sa tres. Unang basket, pasok agad. Para dito, kay Marco Balagtas, unang subok. Swak na swak mula sa labas. Uh, what I heard about the shot is that he looks really conf uh, confident. At saka pasok doon sa sistema lang. Kahit no? na bago pa lang siya sa team na to. Kudal, sumubok bawiin. Long shot, wala. Rebound dito ni Reed Hontilia. Hontilia at Kalo. Familiar ligang labas matchup yun sa Mindanao. At saka sa Cebu. Oh, inagawa ng dalawang kamay. Tinumog eh. Dinambul talaga yung bola. Two minutes. Marky, siya naman ang susubok mula sa labas. Wala, rebound dito ni Huntilia. Pangalawa niya dito sa laro. Pasa dito kay Costello. Balik kay Huntilia para sa dress. Swak na swak. Para dito kay Reed Huntilia. Pampasag sa tabla. 17 to 14. Timeout dito ang Davao Occidental Tigers. Coach Christian, isa pa nga. Para dito kay Reed Huntilia. Give it up to get it back. Ganda ng forward pass. Attracts the defense and a smart pass right there by Costello. Easy walk-in three 
by Reid Hontilia. Timeout muna tayo, Coach Cristian. Labang na tatlo dito ang Zamboanga Care of That Three by Reid Hontilia. Tres hermanos para sa Zamboanga Families Brand Sardines. Robin Ronyo, Reed Hontilia at Harold Arboleda. Ito yung mga nagpakitang gilas. Robin Ronyo, one of the top scorers with 17.1 points per game. Hontilia naman, almost 17 a game. Arboleda, double-double average. Isa sa tatlong nag-average na double-double last year sa ating Tato Cup. Last, last, last season. Last season. Last season. And I expect them to not duplicate the same numbers, but, you know, to really play better as a team. Lalong-lalo na sa, kadag, sa karagdagan ni, you know, ni Rafi Reyes, Costello, na nabanggit mo nga, who was a solid guard sa Marikina. Met Salim, who's come from the program of Chang kai and also the, that NU program, uh, fresh from the UAAP. Hey, tubong, nabigyan, no? tubong ano yan, Sambuanga yan. Nabigyan ng pagkakataon. Local nga eh. Local na yeah. player at saka lucky eh. Just a good mix of players. Jumawas. Alam naman natin na, you know, ito et yung tipong player magpapakamatay sa bola. Saka local yan dyan ha? Local din Bata dyan. Bata palang inaalagaan yan ng programa ng Sambuanga. At nadala nga sa San Sebastian. Offensive foul on yeah. the kick. Offensive foul dito si Reed Hontilia. Napapitik yun dun sa jump shot eh. And this is what, you know, what makes the MPBL more exciting, better anticipation. Nagkakaroon ng mga, you know, free agency, lumilipat yung mga players, and then different looks. So stop dito para sa Zamboanga, tatong kanilang lamang. Final 43 seconds ng ating first quarter. Halo, 4 on 3. Bounce pass, mapunta kay Pogs Raimundo, pasabit! Walang iniwas talaga dun si Steve Kodal, ang laki niya. Right. Tumama, contact, at uh, Bogs Raimundo, easing, easy. Getting a basket there. Well, this was almost a turnover, you see right there, almost a dri double dribble violation. Just slow to the ball and slow to read that pass was Kodal, and Raimundo doing what he does best. The best nakita natin sa buong playoffs yan, that three point play rim run, no? rim yeah. run, catch and finish. So, palit ng tao dito ngayon. Alan Santos para kay Steven Kudal. Final 36 seconds dito sa ating first quarter. Tabla tayo, 17. Ang magkabilang kumunan. Costello, kick out. Kay Salim, pump fake. Bagyang umupo pa, wala ang kanyang tira. Terzo, pinapakalma ang mga tropa. Last shot time. Two second differential between shot clock and game clock. Single high screen, galing kay Balagtas. Terzo, para sa tres. Casado at sigurado. Right at the nick of time, making that three, at binigyan ng tatlong puntos na lamang ang Davao Occidental Tigers. Ganda ng last possession na yun. And, you know, really, miscommunication on the hedge. Medyo hilaw, kaya na libre. At alam naman natin, ito si Terzo is a jump shooter, especially going to his right. At yun na sa ating mga highlights na yun. Devera, nakadalawang three-point shots. Straight away from top of the key. Marco Balagtas naman bumawi. Hindi naman papatalo ang mga bigs dito ng Davao Occidental Reed Hontilia pangatlong three point shot para dito sa Zamboanga Families Brand Sardines pero Joseph Terzo tinultukan ang ating first quarter with a big three point shot ating end of first quarter score 20 to 17 para sa Davao Occidental second quarter sa aming pagbabalik
You're still tuned in to Maharika Pilipinas Basketball League Lacan season. Coach Raymond Valenzona is pleased with the enhancement of his team. Mas mabilis sa talented guards. Nakadagdag pa dito ang bagong shooters making some buwanggang scoring team. Ngunit kailangan pa rin improve at mag-focus sa depensa. Sabi ni Coach Raymond, walang pressure ang larong ito dahil kilala naman ng lahat ang Davao. Pero hindi dapat mag-relax. At kung ano man ang naging focus nila sa ensayo, yun ang gusto niyang makita sa larong ito. Martin and Coach Christian. Maraming salamat, Sheila. Ito merong konting uh, love tayo dito dahil... Uh, I think yung uh, headband dito ni uh, James Forrester. Eh. Tinago naman niya yung sa likod yung bandana. At parang durar yung dating eh. Pero dito swing pass mabunta kay Eman Calo. Bagyang nabitawan, Forrester. Sa harapan ni Arboleda. Nabitawan ng bahagya yung bola. Nakita natin eh, on the follow through. Nadulas, no? Nadulas, eh. Nakita natin, eh. Of course, James Forrester naglaro para sa Arellano University in the NCAA. Spent a few years sa uh, PBA. Uh, uh, Coach Leo Isaac, time or Coach Koy Banal? Koy Banal, Koy Banal. Koy Banal. Right? Koy Banal. Well, who's now in the States? Who well, has two kids who are running uh, programs? Yeah. Yeah. Two teams. Yeah. Siya lang yung inaantay dito. Coach Koy! Both, uh, both played for him. One of the more uh, interesting characters in Philippine basketball. Samantala, Harold Arboleda para sa Dres Mintes. Offensive rebound ni Alan Santos na tapik. Pero ang possession, mananatili. Pero itong medyo umiika si Forrester. No? Might have twisted his ankle. At papalitan siya dito ni Richard Albo. Natapilok. Ito, walking gingerly. Natapilok. Itong si uh, James Forrester. Panahon mo ba pagka natatapilok? Coke 500 pa rin. Coke 500, di ba? Coke 500. No, panahon nila Coach Aldi, ganun eh. Pagka natapilok, Coke 500. Roll nyo lang. Pero balik tayo dito sa ating... Uh, Live action. Robin Ronyo, first time he passed up dito. On our ball game. Second quarter na. Ganun yeah. kalalim yung rotation ni Coach Raymond. Parehas, parehas malalim tong team nito. Nakita naman natin si Reed Hontilia. Pinasok halos 8th, ninth man na siya. Usually, when Started, he was coming no? off the bench, as, well, Six if he was not four, starting, eh. he was the next first guy to come off the bench. Tsaka sa haba ng season natin. Single, exactly. Single yeah. elimination, single round, uh, single round Robin. Yeah. 30 games. Talagang oh. importante na malalim yung bench. Oh. Yeah, I was getting to that point kasi, you know, usually the first maybe five, six games, especially if you have new additions on the floor, you want to mix, ano, try to set some combinations, mix it up. Tingnan mo kung yung mga magandang combination in certain situations. Kaya yung mga nasa reserve list mo. Kasi as far as I know, meron tayong, meron tayong 22 players 22 players sa ating roster na pwede mong i-rotate. So, meron kang sampung reserve. From, from, from 20 oh. last season. Oo, oh, tas pitong ex-pro. Pitong, dati lima lang. Five, oh, yeah. oh. Ngayon, ito nga, katabi natin si uh, Head of Basketball Operations, League President, Coach Zaldi Reyalubit, giving us information here na kailangan natin on, on the technical side of things. Na, kasi sa haba nung season natin, nakikita natin na pag meron kang mga rotation players sa may sampu hanggang labing dalawang games na mabibigay na maganda. Okay na okay. Pero dito, Leo De Vera. Pangatlo. Tama ba? Pangatlong Pangatlo three-point shot ni Leo De Vera. Siyam na puntos. Playing inspired basketball. Uh, it's good to see a guy like Leo De Vera. Especially with, you know, what happened to him. I believe he was cut from the team. Oh, that towards yeah, the playoffs. Maybe the last two weeks. And then for him to come out in wearing a new jersey, and to, and to start like this. Uh, starting like a house on fire. Ito si Leo De Vera. Parang si Joseph Terzo, nakalimang puntos na rin dito. Off the bench after that. Malakas yan. Beautiful drive. Pero ito, tragic pass para kay Bonbon Custodio. Lakas! Nung pasa na yun. Dire-direcho sa outside. At yung crossover, ball fake, sidestep to finish ni Joseph Terzo. Swabing-swabe on that layup. Arboleda ngayon. Alan Santos. The dribble drive ang ini-execute dito ng Zamboanga. Kitang-kita natin on their initiation. Four out, one in offense. Custodio. Pihit. Pasa. Richard Albo para sa tres. Mintes. Tabig sa bola dito para kay Custodio. Pasa sa ilalim. 
Folks, Raymundo taking the contact at napachacha, napaapak, natawagan ng outside. Posibleng nasaktan din sa lakas ng bangga ni Alan Santos. Tsaka parehas sila nakaangat eh. Uh, Tuwagalaw din to si Bogs Raymundo. Pero ang tama kasi is chest to shoulder. Legal. legal kaya, kaya, kaya walang ano, kaya yeah. walang foul na itatawag. Ngayon, pasa muna natin kay Nikki Viola. May update siya sa atin tungkol sa Davao. Siyempre gusto ni Coach Don Duling na maipanalo ang first game nila pero mas importante sa kanya na mas maramdaman ng kanyang players ang teamwork and chemistry ng bawat isa sa loob ng court. Off the court po sayo na si Coach Don sa pagkakasundong ipinapakita ng bawat isa. So uh, sana mailabas daw nila yun tonight sa kanilang laro. Back to you guys. Maraming salamat, Nikki. Yan ang nakikita natin ngayon. Pero dun sa stop to the fast break, tinawagan ng foul si Robin Ronyo. Contact. Apalit ng tao dito. But Ludovice para kay uh, Joseph Terzo. Ganda rin ang uh, inilaro niya rito. Nakikita natin, Coach Christian, yung rotation nila on the backcourt, no? Talagang uh, mga steady players lang. Wala oh. erratic. And serviceable guys. Mm -hmm. uh, tulad ni Richard Albo, na, who came in late for Navotas. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for Navotas. Sila nila Jojo Dunsil. And, and I thought gave them, you know, good number quality of games. Minutes, yeah. no, quality minutes, good number quality of possession. games. Silang naman ang gusto mo eh. Pumasok sa playoffs yan. San Juan was just too much. Wala, <laughs> tapat lang talaga sa San Juan eh. Everybody was too much. At least it felt that way. <laughs> Kasi pagdating dun sa dulo, hindi ka nga yung mga veterano mo na talaga yung magdadala. At pagkapokpokan na yung mga ex-pro mo, yun din yung magdidikta ng laro. I mean, alam ko, dikit yung mga games especially nung finals but except you know except for that last one minute and 30 where it, it felt na talo na sila you know, they just you know fought their way back in and you know clarito aside from that series you know in the, sa manila series pa lang where he had he, he had that breakout game pitong, labing pitong rebound niya sa isa in, Man oh, in Manila. Manila. In Manila. Diba? And samantala, ito si uh, Med Salim showing some rage. Kasado at sigurado mula sa labas. Throwing it from the outside. Davao ngayon, inigot ang bola mula kanan papunta sa kaliwa. Van Ludovici attacks baseline. And off the pro hub. And finish para kay Van Ludovici. Oh, what a beautiful move that was. Right to left, left to right. Nahuilo na. Ganda pa ng finish. Like a break jump, no? Di in eh. De Vera. Salim. Drives. Has a quickness Good advantage. Pass. Robin Ronyo kilala yan. Sa outside shooting, pero wala ang kanyang tira. Bad pass. Good rebound. Pero taking the contact tong si Robin Ronyo, catching it in traffic. And almost getting tackled by Ivan Ludovice. The foul on Ivan Ludovice. Alam mo, hindi ko maintindihan, no? Kung compression shorts ba ito, mga suit mga players. Paiksige ka ng pasigipan na ng shorts. Pero kaya, Coach Christian, ang mamaya sasagutin natin yung tanong niya. Lamang ng isa na lang dito ang Davao Occidental kontra sa Buwaka. Time out muna tayo. mga walang hilig makipagpanggaan. Rudy Distrito, of course, sa original Big Mama, Romulo Mamaril, at si Peter Aguilar, yung mga walang hilig sa kiskisan. O oh, yung Tomasian, huwag makalimutan. Ay, syempre. Sino, banggitin mo, banggitin mo. Merson Oreta. Ay, yan. Yan ang pinaka-importante. Mahilig din sa kiskisan. Back with the vengeance, Marky Bonbon Custodio at Billy Robles. Mga numero nila lahat nagtala ng double digits sa scoring. Pero rebounding, Marky, talagang namamaya ni Jan. Pero panibagong simula na to. At uh, again, Davao sticking to the core of their team. 
nawala lang sa kanila. Notably, you know, Leon Ahordo, I believe, is in Bataan. But this team, talk about a chip on their shoulder. Tingnan natin if they have that chip na sinasabi. We shall see. Makikita natin kung talaga may rest back nga dito ang Dabo Occidental Tigers. Cesar Santua, idiniig, isiniksik. Finger roll pasok para dito kay Cesar Santua. Alam mo, kagandahan pag may mga bag additions ka, especially after a long season 2 and another long season 3. Players like Chester Saldua who gives you energy, malaking bagay sa team yan to uplift not only your contribution but really your spirit ng team. Exactly, kumbaga eh, wild card. Diba? Pagka ipinasok mo, gaganahan maglaro yung mga kakampi. Para uh, battery pack, recharge. Ito ngayon, top of the key, si Ben Salim, natapikan ni Mark Yee. Saldua, ang nakatapat kay Arboleda, pero ito ngayon, huntin yan, ang gusto natin ng tres, wala. Foul yun kay Saldua. And a foul here on Chester Saldua. Makatong team foul dito, ng Davao Occidental Tigers, based on inbound para sa Zamboanga. Puntilya ngayon, nasa harapan niya si Billy Robles. Arboleda, trying to go downhill. Rafi Reyes on the pull-up. Rafi Reyes! No? Talagang at the apex, sa taas ng talon, saka binitawan. It's no secret, Rafi Reyes ever since his uh, UE Red Warrior days, those are strong legs. Oh, talagang uh, explosive eh. Saka ang bigsi. Hindi lang vertical, pati side to side. Ang galing gumalaw. Pero ito, Otra Chempo, chopping his steps and finishing with the left hand to si Aron Tarboleda. Caught sleeping was a transition defense that time. Easy rebound, easy outlet, easy two. Oh, Marking it, Dinoble sa poste, cross court pass kay Ivan Ludovice. Saldua para sa tres. Wow. Aron Sonata, pasok para dito kay Chester Saldua. Refresh my memory, hindi ko alam na meron pala siya noon. Hindi siya tumitira gaano dahil right. inaasahan siya maging uh, post-up threat which is not really strongest suit. Dahil ano to, parang ang Leo de Vera, energy right. guy, offensive rebounder, may tira sa labas. Med Salim going left. Showing some moves. Very familiar kayo dito kay uh, Med. Naglaro sa programa ninyo ng high school to. Coach yes, a former player under Coach Goldwyn Monteverde who is now the head coach of Patangas Tandoy Athletics. Great jump hook, and they're matched up na to, Saldua at Salim. Reyes, another pull up, rinse and repeat. Kumbaga, kusutin mo at isampay, matutuyo yan. Ganda ng bitaw ni Rafi Reyes, masok na masok yung jump shot. Ito kaya Billy Reyes, on the screen. Crossover, pasa kay Saldua. Saldua trying to go downhill. Being tragic there. And the pass going to the sideline. Apologizing to the fan of the dive. So, si Med Salim. At napa timeout mo na dito ang Zamboanga Family's brand starting. Sigit pa rin tayo, Coach Christian. One point lead lang para sa Davao. Senator Manny Pacquiao on your screens. Commissioner Kenneth Dorendez on his left. That is greatness. Of course. And are you telling natin points per game and defense ng magkabi lang kopunan? Davao talagang showing the clamps. Almost a nine point differential. That's 8.6 points differential. 
Ayan naman, finalist din talaga itong Davao Occidental Tigers. At nakita natin, nung regular season, defending like right. a black vice itong uh, Davao Occidental. Well, whatever the character of your coach is, which Don Dulay is, he, he's a, back in the day, uh, he was a solid point guard, spot-up shooter, lefty, but also took pride in playing defense. Very tough defender. Playing defense. And as a coach, yun yung pinapakita niya na nagre-reflex sa kapuna niya ngayon. And uh, Rapid A, six points in yung quarter na to. Sunod, sunod, sunod. <laughs> Mga baskets. So, pasok tayo sa huling dalawang minuto ng ating first half. Ngayon si Bon Bon Custodio. Rapid A sa nasa harapan. Offensive foul. Offensive foul. Offensive foul. Kitang-kita. Ito yung sinasabi natin, aside from, you know, being very familiar with Bon Bon as a long-time teammate, Rafi Reyes is an excellent on-the-ball defender. defender. Saka nakita mo, hindi lang siya vertically mabilis eh. Yung mix niya, on the shuffle, ayun o, nandurun na yung unang step niya, nakukover yung ground. Very basic. Pero ito, Bon Bon, nakakuha ng stop. Marky. Bit bet, taking the contact, may tapik. Wow. So, sa paa niya. I'm surprised with the no call. Yung, ham, yung hampara braso dalaw, eh. Parang dalawang swipe ang nakita ko ron. I'm just not sure if it was enough contact. But still a no call. Brasong braso. Pero walang tawag. Ito naman sa laro. Extension lang ng bola. So bang bang call. Bola kayo ng Zamboanga. Lamang sila ng isa. 33 to 32. Reyes feeling it. And missing it. Napal dito si Med Salim. Matak. Foul number 34, Med Salim, that is second. So foul dito si Med Salim, so may warning pa. Ang uh, Davo Occidental for improper bench decorum. Yung tema nung laro natin, Coach Christian, ang ganda. Play of game, no? Ang ganda. Execution, no four shots, looking for the best shot available. Right. Quality players. Mm -hmm. Ito yung uh, quality team, coaching staff. Speaking of quality team, quality coaching staff by the Davao Occidental Tigers being held by Coach Don Dulay, Rock, Coach Rob Wainwright, Coach Matt Makalintal, their conditioning coach, is also on the bench. And a foul here on Rafi Reyes. That's the first team foul. 14 seconds. Final minute and 8 seconds. Dito sa ating... Second quarter. Final minute of a stop here. Ang Zamboanga. Zamboanga, para naman dito sa Davao Occidental, Marky Eman Calo, Marco Balagtas, Billy Robles at Ivan Ladovice, yan ang lima. Stop dito, pero Helter Skelter, nakagaw naman dito ni Calo, dere-derecho nagmamadali, Calo binitbet, umupo, pasok, off the glass para kay Eman Calo. Med Salim ngayon. Hand off Steve Kodal. Hand off pabunta kay Choi Ignacio. May konting kiskisan doon. Salim with a pump fake. Nabitawan ng bola. Pagsak dito. Ignacio. Sumiksik. Natapik. At Eman Calo na agaw ng dinediretso. Ito na si Van Ludovice. Making a basket here. Tabla tayo. Start the third quarter. And two straight turnovers by Sambuanga to start the quarter as well. Butilia ngayon. Binabagabag ni Calo. Hand off dito, Steve Kudal. Another turnover. Bola dito sa Davao Occidental. Coach Christian, daming nakatutok sa atin ngayon all over the world from California as we see this stop 
steal and fast break by Ivan Lodovice. Of course, a dear family sa Manitoba, Canada. Hogalde family nakatutok sa atin via live stream. Magandang magandang uh, araw po sa inyo dyan. Pati na rin sa Valencia Bukid nun. Ating mga nakatutok dyan supporting this uh, mga Mindanao teams. Eh. Ayun na, nakita natin Basilan ngayon, Zamboanga at Davao naman. Another turnover mm -hmm. by Zamboanga. Uh, Marky. Wala ang kanyang tira, pero Marco Balagtas nandun doon. Yun yung kagandahan na ngayon. Si Marky, kahit tumira sa labas, meron ang mga re-rebound sa ilalim. At namang na dito ang Davao, nagpakawala ng quick 6-0 run. Kaya naman, nakuha na nila ang lamang dito. 38-36, to timeout tayo. Ready to attack, Marco Balagtas at Ivan Ludovice. Balagtas naglaro sa Rizal Crusaders. Sa Bataan Tricers naman galing si Ivan Ludovice. Magandang addition to, nabangin nga natin. Sabi mo nga, before the, you know, the start of the game, kinuha lang ni Coach Don Dula of what he felt the players that he needs on the team. And these are two, two players wherein a guy like Balagtas can stretch the floor and at the same time rebound. Ludovice can take out or can relieve rather the pressure of ball handling a Bon Bon Custodio and can score as well. Billy Ray Robles. And Billy Robles getting another basket. 8 to 0 run para sa Davao Occidental Tigers. Ito talaga yung uh, marka sa kanila. Eh. Magaling tumipensa at nakakapag-fabricate ng mabibilis na puntos. Med Salim with a pump fake. Drive. At sumabit dito ang depensa ni Marco Balagtas. Dito nakikita natin yung uh, young legs ni Med Salim. Oo. Oh. So how about yung tiwala na binibigay sa kanya ni Coach Raymond Valenzona? Very rare do you see. He's a rookie. Sa, sa liga natin. Fresh from college. Very rare do you see na pagpasok of a fresh player from college getting heavy minutes right off the bat at yun ang binibigay sa kanya ngayon ni Coach Raymond so first free throw dito pasok para kay uh, Med Salim second free throw coming up nasabi nga natin Coach Christian sa National University naglaro to ng uh, kolehyo so, double lane violation jump ball possession arrow para sa Davao Occidental Tigers. Pagbinis na na, 8-1 run. It's really more of Sambuanga. How sloppy they have been offensively to start the third quarter. Four straight turnovers in less than two minutes. Bigat yun. Napanta third. So ating talaan ngayon, 40-37 for Davao Occidental. Ivan Dodovice nagbababa ngayon ng bola. Marco Balagtas, Eman Calo. Nagkaroon na switch, quick slip. May Balagtas, high glass, pasok. Marco Balagtas. Para ay Marco Balagtas, mga coaches natin. Coach Christian, scouting ngayon, watching us and enjoying the game. Coach Rene Baina. And of course, Coach J.V. Gayoso of the Rizal. Crusaders watching. Ito yung slip ni Marco Balagtas. Hindi na binaba yung bola, basic na basic. And how about the screen? Kitang-kita sumabit. At yung timing ng, ng pag-slip uh, niya at pagpasa and showing the touch. Yun yung importante, eh, yun doon sa replay natin, hindi ipinaba yung bola. Nasa, it, nasa itaas lang ng balikat, kaya hindi natapit sa ilalim. Sa lib, libre, mula sa labas. He has that. Kanta ng pitaw at best sa lib. 
point shot for him. Pangalawa na niya to. I don't think I've ever seen, because we covered the UAP, I don't think I've ever seen him move this way, play this way confidently. Mas nagkaroon ng kumpiyansa right. eh, na empower ni Coach Ray. Makikita mo sa body language pa lang eh. Saka itindig niya, no? Mas Pag, uh, kumpiyansa. Iba rin talaga eh. Pag, pag ano eh, you play for your for your place, for your city. Oo, oh, oh, diba? <laughs> Kasi local nga yan. In between mid sa deep and uh, itong si uh, Leo De Vera, meron na silang limang three-point shots. Eh, hindi ako nagkakamali, ah. I need to check that. I think si De Vera may tatlo. At itong si... Uh, Pull up. May dalawa. Pasok. Para kay Ivan Lulubise. Ganda ng pita. Pasa muna natin kay Nikki para sa update sa Davao. For the second half, in advice lang ni Coach Don Dulay na dapat mas intense ang kanilang depensa, bawasan ang turnovers, and uh, most importantly, they have uh, to rebound the ball better para mas makalamang sila for this quarter. Back to you guys. Maraming salamat, Nikki. Salim pala. Isang three-point shot pala. Isa jumper. Okay, si Terzo. Pull up by Joseph Terzo para sa tres. Mintes. Rebound dito ni De Vera. Tumatak po dito ngayon si Arboleda. Sinalos. Yes. Saktong sakto. Kaya na pasa, bounce pass. Sakto sa kabay ni Joseph Nalos. And beautiful block out by De Vera to get the rebound that ignited the break on the two-on-one. De Vera again, making things happen with that loose ball. From Joseph Nalos. Just the spark they need after the slow start itong third quarter. Pasok, mapasok. Ang result pala, hindi na sila crusaders ngayon. Golden coolers. Billy Robles ngayon. Nakasona ang depensa ng Zamboanga. Shifting zone sila eh, no? Man zone talaga eh. Pull up by Billy Robles. Wala. Grabe yung pisigalan dito. A terrific post defense by Arboleda. At Hontilia. Pasabit. At foul dito. Si Ivan Ludovice. Balagtas was trying to post up itong si Arboleda, but very deceptive ito si Arboleda who really plays bigger than his size. Nabanggit natin kanina, one of three players, I believe, averaging a double-double in season two. And also a capable, he showed there, he's a capable defender on the post. Nap-na-prevent niya kay Balagtas. Led to this fast break, read on the line for a pair. First free throw dito. Para kay Reed Huntilia. Forty-five to forty-four. Second free throw para kay Huntilia. Pasok. So, balikan lamang dito sa Zamboanga. Ito ngayon si Mark E. Handoff papunta kay Bon Bon Custodio. Kababalik niya lang dito sa second half. Robin Ronyo nakatapat sa kanya. Billy Ray Robles. At Billy Robles nakakuha ng basket. Oh, Leo De Vera. Masyado lang malalim yung pagkakasalo niya sa bola. Wala yung tira dito ni Harold Arboleda. Ito na ngayon si Billy Robles. Bounce pass papunta kay Mark E. Mark E taking the contact. Falling down, pero two free throws para dito kay Marky. Tabla tayo, 46 all. Uh, that's not a smart play. By, that's more of Alan Santos. I thought he gave away that possession. Right? He had a chance to challenge up top. He has the height, obviously. But hindi mo pwedeng i-bail out yung offensive player. Nasa salubungin mo na lang. Oh, yung contact, and then, yung katawan. This is a freebie na binigay niya kay Marky. Who's been struggling, by the way. I believe that's his first point. Oh, hindi pa nga siya nakakabutas. Yung palang, yung unang free throw ni Marky. If he makes it on top, then, you know, just gotta tip your cap. Baba ka na lang, di ba? At least you, were, you, you challenged him. Submission. Robbie Reyes, a bag in the game for Joseph Thomas. So, ito ay si Robin Roy na nagbababa ng bola. Pasa dito kay Leo De Vera. 
Handoff pabunta kay Arboleda. Ngayon pa sila nag-weave dito. Yung triple weave talaga yung ginagamit nilang initiation ng triple drive nila eh. Somebody has to drive though. Like this one. Kick Great out. Open shot. Corner three. Ronyo. That's an offensive foul. Offensive foul. Yeah, clearly. Clearly. Yeah, and the struggle continues para kay Ronyo. Still scoreless in this ball game. A player that averaged you know, 15, 16 points last season mm -hmm. as a 17 plus points. Right, there you go. Ronyo, dahil may mga 20 plus outbursts. Ano yung sipa? Sumabit sa paa ni Joseph Terzo dahil yung sipa niya. Diretso sa paa. Tingnan natin, nire-review dito na ating mga officials. I, are they gonna consider this as an unsportsmanlike foul? Kasi nag-extend towards the landing spot. Pwede, yeah. pero most probably hindi. Kasi yung sipa niya papunta dun sa landing spot ni Joseph Terzo. Because the call is an offensive foul. I think what they're reviewing is if it can be escalated to a sportsman like. But I think no, because regardless of the landing, the initiation, the pagsipa, the pagclip sa pa. So what's the review for? Ayun na tinitig na natin kung that's ano ang tawag na ating mga official. You know, in a way, it makes sense if they do, because. It can obviously hurt the defensive player. Oh, there you go. So that's an offensive foul. That's an offensive foul. No uh, unsportsmanlike foul for Robin Rodney. So ito ngayon, si Billy Robles siya nagbababa ng bola. Ang nakatapat sa kanya si Harold Arboleda. Chester Saldua, balik na rin sa laro. Joseph Terzo. Dinoble, kick out, libre from top of the key. Itong si Marky, wala. Alas kalawinin dito ni Billy Robles yung rebound. Pero tapika, napunta kay Rafi Reyes. Ronyo ngayon, hinatak ng bahagya. Arboleda, Reyes, shiftiness. And display at yeah. foul dito si Bonbon Custodio dun sa sundot. Yeah, Rafi sold that call. <laughs> Pagka drive niya, pinakita lang niya na yung handshake. Kitang-kita. Ngayon, pasa mo na natin kay Sheila. May update siya sa atin tungkol sa Zamboanga. Sheila. Keep on pushing. That was Coach Raymond's reminder. Work on offense at makipag-iinan sa depensa. Ngayon pa lang, they have to pressure. Makipagsabayan sa pisikalan and tear down ang mga veterano ng Davao. Alam nila, pagdating ng fourth quarter, aarangkada ang mga ito. Hindi na nila dapat bigyan ng pagkakataon. Makabuelo ang Davao dahil sila din ang mahihirapan sa huli. Martin and Coach Christian. Maraming salamat, Sheila. Huwag nang pabuluhin. Pero ngayon, lamang dito ang Davo at nakakuha pa ng loose ball foul si Marky kay Alan Santos. Ito off the roll. Ayan, okay na ba? Klinip eh. Tapos may konti forearm sa likod. Ni Marky. Alam mo, sa galing ni Marky, kumuha ng offensive rebound. It's almost some, like sometimes you have to face front him. Dal maganda yung box out ni Alan Santos doon, pero at the last minute, bumitaw lang. So Chester Saldua. Paul Gaunted para kay Chester Saldua. So here's the play. Marky does not get this one to go. Might have been clip on the arm, but a good job of staying active on the offensive class and Chepre picking up your runner-up MVP to MVP on your team. So timeout muna dito. Apat ang labang ng Davao Occidental.
At nandito tayo ngayon sa Mall of Asia Arena para sa unang araw ng inyong Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League Lacan Season. Yan ang tawag natin ngayon. Leadership test. Jimwell and Michael. In attendance. Saldua on the bonus free throw. Maganda yung nilalaro dito ni Chester Saldua. Yeah. Tapos yung first half natin, may sampung puntos na siya. Ngayon, labing tatlong puntos para sa kanya. At natabayan na din natin, Harold Arboleda. Two points shy of 500 points. Coach Christian, ha? 500 na? Oo, oh, 500 na. Dami na niya sinut. Reyes. Ikot dito ang bola. Balik kay Arboleda. 500 na ba? So, itong pagkakataon na to, mukhang passable to eh. Yeah, Pero but penalty, penalty na. Sa pagkakataon itala ang kanya 499 at 500 career points sa MPBL. In the second easiest way. Free throws. Mm -hmm. Ano yung easiest? Uh, Siyempre, a layup. Breakaway yeah, layup. Yeah, breakaway layup. Mas madali pa rin yun. Oh, naman. <laughs> Pero may mga kilala ko, nagbimintis pa ng ganun eh. Oh, mas maraming two free throws. Ako, oh, sure ball. So, 499 points. Panglimandaan na ba? At mukhang ikakasa mo na. Limang daang puntos para sa karera ni Harold Arboleda dito sa ating uh, Maharlika Pilipinas Basketball League. Dapat mabibigay natin yung game ball, lalo na pag nanalo sila. Bagong-bago pa naman yung ball. Nahirap yun, ha? 500 points. 500 points. In the span of three seasons, no? So, Saldua. Baka tayong Kaya, dalawa eh. Kahit combined. Kahit, combined. Kahit, kahit combined pa, combined. may hapan tayo. Kasi isa yung 499, akin yung one. Okay na yun. Sampung season yun. Okay. <laughs> so dito kayo nagmamadali. Itong si... Uh, Harold Arboleda kina sa corner. Nice. They swing it around. Pero yung layup ni Rafi Reyes, wala. Custodio. Napitawa ng bola. Nabulan sa ilalim. Marky for the rebound. For that two small rather. At merong uh, pito dito. Come on, jump ball. Jump ball session arrow is pointing. Sa bola ng sambuang ka dito. Ang bola, tatlo ang kailang hinahapol. Pasok tayo sa ulit dalawang minuto ng ating third quarter. Di natin napapansin, no? Ganun kabilis sumakbo yung oras. Dahil layup style maglaro yung dalawang koponan. Walang nasasayang na possession. Hindi tatakbo kung hindi kailangan. They would use the possession. Milk the clock. Well, especially yung crowd ng Sambuanga. <laughs> It's like the playoffs. Eh. Oh, no, kinuha eh. lahat. Kinuha yung kabilang side nila. Eh. Oh, tip in dito ni Leo Devera. Push from behind. Pero may tulak. Ito madalas natatawagan si Leo Devera ng ganyan. No? Yung buwelo niya. Sa may biglang tatalon. So may warning na rin dito ang bench ng Zamboanga. Wala, <laughs> takatingin sa taas, inaantay yung replay. Eh. Okay, wala, 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 replay. Walang replay. Ganda kasi nung tip in, eh. akala ko counted. So, Albo ngayon. Terzo, meron sila labing walong segundo sa shot clock. A minute and 37 remaining. Sa ating ikatlong yun to, Terzo, sinubukang biyakin yung double team. Saldua. Handoff, Albo, para sa dos. Tres pa na yun. Meron siya niyan. Kala ko, stepping yung uh, isilenyas ni Red J. Castro Verde. Nakaangat pala yung three points. So, kasadot sigurado mula sa labas si Richard Albo. It's really an awkward, quick trigger shot. Not, Pero shooting. Not so much art to it. But he, <laughs> What's he, the shoot? He has showed na last season pa lang na nakakashoot siya sa ganyan. <laughs> Ayun na naman ang kwentuhan dyan, Coach Christian. Nasot mo ba? Eh, basta nashoot, walang problema. Terzo. Albo, isa pa ba? Wala doon sa pangalawang tira pero tulak dito si siya naman. Chester Saldua. Pati siya alam niya eh. Pangalawang beses na siyang natawagan na ganyang uh, tipo ng foul. Two small fouls, tulak. Yun ang mabigat doon, penalty. So Harold Arboleda pang anim na biyembro ng 500 point club. We have Chito Jaime, Alan Mahas. Alan Mahas. Yung pa ba yung tatlo? Chito Jaime, Alan Mangahas. Ito, mapacheck natin sa ating stats. 
I think... Uh, so, tignan natin. Ha? Papacheck natin sa ating mga stats team kung sino ang uh, miyembro. Mike Wico. Mm -hmm. Mike Wico, tignan natin. Oh, ito pala. Si uh, Tito Jaime. Uh, Judric Valoria. Jay Colliado. Jay uh, Alan Mangahas. Egilos. At Jaymo Egilos. Ayan. Si Mike Wico sigurado. Oh, meron na pala silang listahan na ka-ready. Pa papunta na siya ron. Oo. Oh, ayun, may si Mike Wico isang conference, uh, isang season palang naglalaro. At mayroon pa mga suspension last year. Diba? Pero sa 20 ang inilaro, parang mga 10, naka-20 puntos. Oo. Oh, oh. Masama pa yung pakiramdam niya nung kababalik na galing injury. And what's more impressive, that's without a jump shot. That's without a jump. At there, saka hindi, there, hindi kang kung maglaro eh, no? May mga laro na hindi po, kahit isang attempt wala siya sa 3 points. Yan ang pinakamagaling doon. Ah, ang long shot na niya yung free throw eh. Yun yung long shot niya eh, no? I mean, obviously marurunong yung mga coaches and teams natin dito. So, what would be the usual scouting? If not the only scouting, lay off. Bigyan mo na space. And yet, close to 20 points per game. Aray, ang Costello. Pasa dito ngayon kay Reed Huntilla. Single high screen, galing kay Leo De Vera. Huntilla ng Orsonada mula sa labas. Jump shot, baka mo. Bakit nga naman hindi kung si Reed Huntilla yung mga Orsonada? No, alas madapa dito si Costello na na-crossover na lang ni uh, Joseph Terzo. Pero aga, wow! Dive dito ni Costello. Bowling pass. Pumunta kay Huntilla. Half step, bumite, natapikan. Terzo. Saldua. Good pass. Albo, tatapusin yung pass break na yan. In the nick of time. Uh, tatlong basket sa tatlong end of quarter sequences na convert. That dive though by Costello is worth a replay. Oo. Oh. Yung mga, eh, that's the highlights natin. Pets sa libro na three-point shot. Pasa kay Marco Balagtas. Basic na basic. Di na binaba. Pasok yung paboarding na tira. Nalos, pumunta kay Huntilla. Totokan na tira. Walang problema. And Lodopise, counter move. One dribble pull up. Butas na butas ang ring para kay Van Lodopise. Natapos ang ating ikatlong yugto na may anim na puntos na lamang ang Davao Occidental kontra sa Zamboanga. 58 to 52. Fourth quarter ng yung MPBL lakan season sa aming pagpapalik. Punong-puno pa rin tayo dito sa Mall of Asia Arena, Coach Christian. Papasok tayo ng fourth quarter. Pero syempre, dahil opening ng MPBL lakad season, bibigay tayo ng motor, courtesy of our partners. At Mary Jean Soto ng Valenzuela City, panalo ng motor. Tinatawag dito ni Commissioner Kenneth Durentes. Mary Jean Soto. Ito'y nahanap. Eh, nahirap pag kawala ka, tapos may hirap na bunot. Nasabihin ng mga nasa crowd, pass na, next na, next, next. Next bunot, next bunot, Coach Christian. Hindi mapintahan, hindi mapintahan ni. Ayan, 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 ayan. PJ Solano. From Paranaque. Wala sa PJ. Paranaque. PJ Solano. O kita mo, pababa pa lang. Sinasabi na nila, wala. <laughs> Ayan natin, ha? baka biglang uh, dalawang motor na yan, Coach Christian. <laughs> Naghulog ka ba? Naghulog ka na entry. 
Secret. <laughs> wala. Wala. Oh, wala. Now, umuli po ba di tayo ng magandang gabi sa lahat ng mga kaibigan nating nakatutok from all Dalawa over the pa, world, wala. all over the Philippines. Dalawa, dalawa. Pati sa mga OFW Parang natin ng mga kaibigan ah. na nakatutok sa atin via live stream. Magandang araw po sa inyo. Martin Antonio at Christian Luanzon on call. Ticket number na lang, di mabasa yung name. 149-999-57. Yun yun yung kagandaan sa crowd, tinasabi pa lang. Meron! Ayan, meron! Ito, meron! Ayan. Meron, meron, dito. Meron! Kasama yata Kasama ni, ni Madam, Madam Claudine. Eh, galing si Galing yung Madam Claudine na mamalapun. Last! Mamalala natin last year. Every time na may laro ang Davao Occidental, talagang they are the ones really... Every game. Oo, ang kanilang partners. 5-7 yung dulo kanina. 5-7. Hindi rin mabasa. Okay, number na lang. 150-290-62. Check your tickets. You know, usually teams would... 150-290-62. Oh. Teams would complain, pero Davao can't because sila yung namimigay ng motor. <laughs> At saka hindi, meron din yata sila mga ticket okay, na hawak eh. <laughs> Wala. Moises Nelson Calios. Calios. Kamag-anak kaya ito ni Coach Monel. Ay, Coach Monel, Monel, Coach Monel no? <laughs> ang hirap, ang hirap sa mga... Wala pa rin. Mga contest na ganito yung pagbunutan. Pag hindi ka mabilis mo baba, wala na agad eh. Wala. <laughs> Wala. Okay, last. Isa pa. Walang pangalan. Eduardo Lucido from Cebu. Lucido. Eduardo Lucido. From Cebu. Mga kaibigan natin dito, of course, waiting for the uh, numbers to be caught. Wala pa rin. Opening. Wala pa rin. Apat na motor. Wala pa rin na nanalo. Lato po yun na yata. Lu Amante. O dahil Laguna. nandun sa mga itaas na kaupo. Ando dun sa taas na kaupo eh. Okay, mamaya na lang isa pag wala pa rin ha. Mamaya na lang. Thank you. So, balik tayo on live action. Ilan yun? Lima? Anim? May dalawa pang hindi mapintahan. <laughs> Ang dami. Marami. Marami pagkakataon. So, balik tayo dito sa ating fourth quarter ng ating uh, second game ng lakan season. Lamang dito ng anim ang Davao Occidental Tigers kontra sa Zamboanga Families brand Sardines 58-52. Oh, it's Christian. Mga nakatutok pa rin sa atin, ha? Ating mga Armed Forces of the Philippines. Magandang gabi po. Kap uh, Mike Ignario. Yan na rin ang mga taga Surib Surigao del Sur sa Barobo. Yan mga nanonood sa atin. Magandang gabi po sa inyo. And thank you for your service sa mga kasamahan natin, mga kaibigan from the Armed Forces of the Philippines. So scramble dito, Joseph Terzo para sa tres. Wala yung tira. Stop dito ng Zamboanga. Reed Hontilla, kinaliwa, wala. Pero Arboleda na dudod. Hindi ni Insa Dibdib ni Joseph Terzo yung katawad. And one pa nga dito, suwabit, pasok. It would have been a nice rebound by Aldo, who got it with two hands, led to the three-on-one fast break after the turnover. And how about that? We talked about, and I think we've mentioned this a lot of times, Martin, from last season pa lang, 
the best rebounding guard we have in the league. Mm -hmm. Harold Ar Arbole. I know he plays the four, but he's a guard. He's a guard. Just plays undersized. Yeah, right now, he's playing the three with De Vera and uh, Santos, Santos. But at times, he's playing the four. But he's really a guard. And he's the best rebounding guard we have in the league. Jump step. Pull up. Tres. Para kay Richard Albo. Grabe. Ito nung gulaw na yun. Jab, step back, pull up three. Pasok na pasok para kay Richard Albo. Pinawi rin niya yung turnover niya. Yung sa kapila. Akit na naman sa anim. Ang lamang dito. Ito kay si Reed Honquilla. Dumitis karte. Pasok kay Leo De Vera. Dribble hand off. Good pass. Arboleda para sa tres. Mintes sa Donald Arboleda. Bilang 500 points, 480 rebounds na. Pero Marco Balagtas. Basic na parang marquee din siya yeah. eh. Mini marquee pag puminis. Pag salo sa taas, di na ibinababa ang bola. Sneaky sneaky din eh. Oo. <laughs> Just when you thought na wala nang tumatakbo papunta sa kabila. Biglang may lumitaw na lang na white shirt and a good job by Bonbon bon Custodio of keeping his head up. Asahan mo rin naman yun kay Bonbon. Bon. Eh, parehas natin naging kakampi. Basta tumakbo ka lang, field the lane. Ilalagay niya yung bola pag libre ka talaga. Eh. And obviously a player that's not afraid of making the pass. Ito si Bonbon, bon, regardless of the risk. Oo naman. Basta nakita niya yung nakauna, problema mo na sa luhin eh. Nalos, kick out. Oh, yeah. Kinasahan, yung isa sa pa lang. Wala talagang sumalo. <laughs> yung isa sa pa lang kasi si Med Salim. Nakita naman niya, libre. Ikaw naman eh. Libre. Nakita niya sa gilid naman niya. Pero kita mo naman. Yung span of attention niya, di ba? Saan pamunta si Med Salim? Paangat, di ba? O, oh, relocate. Libre niya dun sa wing area. Kaso, pang-anim na player. Sa so, turnover dito ngayon, walo ang labang. Pasa muna natin kay Nikki. Nikki. Coach Don Dulay's plan for the last quarter is basically a pareho lang daw during the third quarter but with much higher intensity daw sana and uh, mas makontrol pa din nila ang bola ngayon. Back to you guys. Maraming salamat, Nikki. Ball control nga. Pero Harold Arboleda sumasagot dito. Marky. Pumunta kay Ludovice. Kapapasok lang para kay Joseph Terzo. Bonbon Custodio. Grabe naman yung galaw. Di lang nga natapos. Dalawa yung pagsak doon sa box out na yun. Pero nakuha pa rin dito na sa buwang gambola. Six point lead para sa Davao. Mismatch. Quick, quick post up. Montilla para ka. Sa poste. De Vera. Wala ang tira. Bonbon Custodio pushing the ball. Custodio bumitbet. Bumitin, wild shot, wala. Rebound di Arboleda, 3 on 1. Buntilia, break jump. Wala. Daming empty trips dito, pero Harold Arboleda. Contact in basket, 482 total career rebounds. Para dito kay Harold Arboleda. Ayan ang mahirap gawin. Yung 500 points, mahirap na ito, mas mahirap. Yung binanggit mo, and again, this is the second 2 plus 1 play in this quarter by Arboleda. Talagang tinatrabaho niya yan. Kaya naman dito na ibaba nila sa apat ang labang. May bonus free throw pa si Harold Arboleda sa aming pagbabalik. Harold Arboleda, may tira sa labas, pinakita win range, pasok yung 3-point shot, tumatakbo sa fast break, kontra Chempo, chopping the steps, kaliwang kamay na finish, at specialty of the house, rebounding, 
and making his presence felt. Harold Arboleda ngayon. May labing apat na puntos, pitong rebounds, apat na assist, pitong puntos dyan. Galing ngayong quarter na to. At ang pinakamahalaga, eh, crucial time for them. We, you know, it felt like at least the start the fourth quarter, Davao was starting to pull away. Lamang ng walo. And then momentum, they had a slight momentum. But because of Arboleda's relentless attitude on the glass, on the offensive glass, this lead is down to a one possession ball game. Good pass, good cut. Lumulisot yung pasa, no? Galing pumasa nito mga kwarta ng magkabilang kumpunan. Arboleda. Mini hesitation move. Reyes, inigot nila dito. Salim. Step back. Juntilia. Pasa kay Salim. That's a foul. Contact. And the basket para dito kay Ben Salim. Aurin Juntilia ngayon. Trying to get a run here. Well, you just have to be impressed on Metzali play tonight. His very first MPBL game. Getting heavy minutes in a crucial stretch. Catch of the basketball. Three-point play coming up. Let's see if he finishes. And he does. Getting a basket here. Plus the contact. Metzali looking focused and playing for his home province. Emancalo. Off the screen, it slips. Got napping. Getting a catch and finish. Uh, that wasn't a nap. That was a overnight sleep. Sakto sakto, nakatalikod si Salim dun sa bole. Kasi dalawang straight na possession eh. First was the cut underneath by Kahlo as the recipient. And Kahlo... Siya naman ang namasa. So two straight lapses on the defensive end by Sambuanga. Ito naman si Harold Arboleda. Salim on the pitch post. Quick high-low action. Arboleda against Robles. De Vera para sa tres. Pang-apat. Pag-feel mo, pukul mo. Leo De Vera. Apat na three-point shot sa larong ito. Labing dalawang puntos. Robles, binawi agad yung three-point shot na nila. Jumper of his own. Akyat na naman sa apat ang lamang dito ng Davao. Salim, binabagabag ni Marquis. Arboleda, dumidiscarte. Nagkaroon ng switch. De Vera, pang lima ba? Pang lima nga! Leo De Vera, five three-point shots para sa kanyang Unang laro dito sa Zamboanga. Post entry. Kick out. Billy Robles. Inisip. Pero ipinasa. Extra pass. Eman Calo. Trying to gash the defense. Ball fake. One shot. Pasok. Eman Calo. And the referee is letting the players play. Pagsak si Rafi Reyes doon. Pero play continues. Harold Arboleda, pasa kay Med Salim. Marky ay nakatapat sa kanya. Double high, stock screen. That's a foul. Oh, easy foul. That's a foul. Yeah, what Veteran a move. Smart play by Arboleda. Tawag sa lalong kalye. Na-experience. Na-experience eh. Nung pang fake. Sumabit eh. Ayun na, tres pa. Sakto-sakto across the arm eh. Free throw para dito kay Harold Arboleda. Make that two more dahil tres nga yun. Susunod-sunod din yung mga nakuha nilang uh, dalawang three-point play para kay Harold Arboleda. Three free throws nyo. Tapos isang three-point play para kay uh, 
Ahmed Salim. And two three-point shots by Leo De Vera. Oh. Pero lamang pa rin dito ang Davao ng isa. Billy Robles, one on one. Mano ay mano, pero wala ang tira. Wala, mananatili sa Davao. Occidental Tigers. Ito, oh, wala yung bagyang uh, kapos yung tira. Rafi Reyes! Pinaganda ba yung layup na yun? Well, that's the beauty of having Arboleda getting the rebound because he can ignite the fast break. Beautiful finish by Reyes and another answer Billy right Billy away Robles. by Ilongo Superman. Oh, Billy Robles, talagang timely baskets niya eh. Good pass. Tapos yung tira, Van Ludovice para sa rebound. Tumatakbo dito ang Davao, 3-on-2, 4-on-2. Eman Calo, tinapos yung fast break. May kasama bang dive? Eman Calo! Ngayon si Reed Hontilia. Papasok tayo sa tatlong minuto at tatlong pong segundo ng ating fourth quarter. Arboleda, double high screen para sa kanya. Umatake sa kaliwa. Marky ang nakapayong. Meron pang tulong galing kay Robles. Salim, kick out. Rafi Reyes, thought about the three. Inilapit, gliding, wala. Offensive rebound na naman ni Arboleda. And nobody boxing out. Harold Arboleda on the weak side. Sipag na lang talaga yung puhunan. Kadalasan talaga, when you're the one that initiates the offense after a drive and kick, hindi ka nababaksa. Na, na, natutulog na yung depensa dahil it was a ball screen on top, it was a clear out para kay Arboleda sa ibabaw. But because of the good double team by Robles, he made a good pass to the other side, swung to the other side. Rafi Reyes with a counter drive. And nobody backs out Arboleda, who initiated the offense. Sam na rebound sa rito, si Harold Arboleda. Closing in to another double-double. Another day in the office. Isang araw na naman sa trabaho. Tinatrabaho din talaga ni Harold Arboleda yung mga rebounds na yan. So he's had maybe five alone dito sa quarter na to. Has been the spark clearly para sa kuponan niya for this run. Kaya naging dikit na ang laban. Dito, yung free throw. Saka consistent from the line, no? Si Harold Arboleda. Kaya Billy Robles. Saldua. Ikot dito kay Bon Bon Custodio. 2-3 zone. Oh, so na nga rito ang Zamboanga. Oh, poor decision by Reyes. Billy Robles, sa man jump shot, wala. Offensive rebound. Si Bon Bon Custodio at foul. Yeah, Rafi Reyes. You cannot gamble in this type of situations in the ball game unless it's very clear, a, a clear steal. Opened up the oh, shot yeah, and the offensive four, rebound. Nagreng five on four kasi yun eh. Pagka gumagamble ka ng sundot, scramble, di may pagkakataon yung uh, isang defensive player to crash the rebound. Ito 15-10 para kay Leo De Vera. Lahat ng puntos na galing sa three-point area at sampung rebounds. On top of that, you know, playing solid defense against Marquis. Mm -hmm. And 63% from the three-point area. 2.6 rebounds, Marquis. Way below his usual. Vera ngayon, handoff. Montilla, punta kay Salim. Five seconds sa kanilang shot clock. Arboleda, trying to force one up. Uy, nahanap pa rin ito si Med Salim. Pero too much passing for the side of Zamboanga. Going to their bread and butter. Kumbaga, ang puhunan, depensa para sa Davao Occidental Tigers. Now, one thing that Zamboanga can exploit on the offensive end is go to Reed Montilla on the post as he has Bonbon bon Custodio on him. I think Reed can either make a shot himself or make a play for his teammates to force the double team. Nice Billy Robles. Eight seconds, the shot clock. 
Six seconds. Running hook. Ni Saldua. Wala. Tapi ka. Nakuha ni Arboleda. Yes. At final two minutes na ating laro. 21 points and 10 boards para dito kay Harold Arboleda. That's Hesitation move yeah, by Billy foul. Robles. Sumabi dito si Leo De Vera. A one point lead para dito sa Davao Occidental Tigers. Ito yung huling downhill drive mula sa rebound. Siya na rin ang tumapos. Harold Arboleda. Ganda rin tapos doon. So, Billy Robles on the line. Pasok yan para dito kay Billy Robles. Muli, Coach Chris, uh, now I want to take this opportunity to thank the Armed Forces of the Philippines, lalong-lalo na it's Independence Day today. Maraming maraming salamat po sa mga kaibigan natin na nagkilikot sa ating bayan. Philippine Army, of course, Philippine Navy, Philippine Air Force, the Coast Guard, Pati na rin natin mga kapulisan na talagang uh, nagbubuhos ng kanilang oras sa ating bayan. At Rafi Reyes, don't talk now. Isa na lang naglabang. Care of another basket by Rafi Reyes. Tignan natin ulit to. Crossing. Joseph Terzo. Springs on his legs. And going over the defenders. At Harold Arboleda din. May 21 po to. Sampung rebound. Most in the league pang dalawang put isang double double dito ni Harold Arboleda isang puntos na lang ang lamang ng Davao 80 to 79 Final minute and 38. Playoff atmosphere. Tinan. Yung tema nung laro natin. Ganun eh, no? Oh. Walang nasasayang na position. Walang nagmamadali. Execution ng labanan. So obviously, Har Arboleda playing a big role in this quarter. Kaya tumikit yung score natin. Also, three-point shooting of Sambuanga. Five in total for Davao. Ten. For Sambuanga, kalahate kay Leo De Vera. One more custodio. Here's that zone once again. Ay natin kung anong gagawin nila dito para pasagin tong zona. Robles, four seconds, gliding and making that shot. Robles! Pagsak dito si Leo De Vera at si Chester Saldoa. Pero big shot para kay Billy Robles. Ito, Billy Robles. Attacking. Ang ganda ng inilaro dito ni Billy Robles sa ating fourth quarter. Right there. Straight line drive down the lane. No call by the officials. Could have been an offensive foul or maybe a three-point play. Nonetheless, Davao extends it this lead to three. So timeout muna tayo. Tatlo ang lamang ng Davao. So the twins are here, enjoying the action. But I'm thinking, talaga sticking to the final buzzer in itong laban natin. Talagang ganda rin kasi, di inan. Si 
Billy Robles coming up big here in the fourth quarter. Pagka nakakaran tong Zamboanga, may sagot siya, eh, no? Full court play, press dito. Uh, pinapakita ng defensa ng Davao Occidental. Uh, thumbs up play. This is gonna be a clear out ball screen. I believe for Arboleda. Pero ito pupuntahan nila. Right here. Pin down, pull up. Casado at sigurado para kay Harold Arboleda. Tabla tayo ngayon. 82 all. Mababa sa isang minuto. Ang nalalabi sa ating laro. 24 puntos para dito kay Harold Arboleda. Mano in mano. Billy Robles. Ano ang sagot ko dito? Isa sa isa. Walong segundo. Terzo. Balik kay Robles. 6 seconds remaining. Billy Robles of the pull up. Wala, Harold Arboleda on the rebound. Mark Pero, Gee once again. Sumiksik talaga dun sa ilalim. Iniumang yung katawan. Sinakripisyo. Yeah. Sinasabi ko sa'yo, earlier it was Alan Santos who did everything, gave every inch to block him out. Mark Gee, you know, rebounding, it's not really a talent. You know, it, it's, some, it's a skill. And Mark Gee, I tell you, kahit na ma-block out mo siya, he just does everything to get the rebound. Extra possession coming up para sa Davao. Nakitang kita yung pag-show eh. Doon sa katawan ni Marky. So, five seconds. Four seconds. Marky on the slip. Marky, napayungan. And right at the nick of time. Tingnan natin. It looked good. Mukhang good. It no, looked good. I-review dito ha. I-review na ating officials. It looked good. Oh, mukhang good niya eh. Tingnan natin. Tingnan natin. Based on the Light of, oh, the, board. Light sa board, Light of no? the board, it looked good. Pero two points lang yan. Meron pang 23.4 seconds dito. Kung ika-count yan, lalamang ng dalawa. Ito, tingnan natin ha. Two seconds na abot. Ayan, malinaw na malinaw. Malinaw na malinaw. At Chester Saldua coming alive again. Maganda yung first half niya. 15 points dito in his debut for the Davao Occidental Tigers. Zamboanga, tawag dito ng timeout ang Zamboanga Families Brand Sardines. I think we will be hanging on air. Coach Christian, kanino mo gusto papuntahin ang bola? It's gotta go to Arboleda, but I like him right now, maybe off the ball, because if you give him the ball right away, especially in a ball screen, you can expect a blitz Exactly. On the, on the pick and roll. So if you use him as a screener, instead he rolls to the basket. If he's open, then give it to him. If he's not, then it forces the defense to rotate. And then you maybe you may have an open shot for the three on the other side. At saka isa pa yung itinakbo nilang play kanina. Instead of being a screener, moving away from the ball, cut, pin down, pag-angat, nakakuha sila ng tres. Nung sequence sa'yo, yun yung pampatabla. Right. So, 23.4 seconds remaining para sa Zamboanga. And they opt to, uh, ano ba to? ilapit yung bola sa kanilang half court. Pagka ginawa mo yan, automatically yung shot clock bababa sa 14 seconds. So, two possession ball game pa to. Mukhang si Arboleda nga ang magiging screener dito. Yeah, triple stack screen mukhang papunta kay Reed Huntilla. So they changed their mind. Mm -hmm. Kasi gusto nga ubusin ni gusto nga ubusin ni Coach Raymond Valenzona yung oras. Even though they're down by two. Oo, oh, kasi krinokis nga nila eh. Krinokis nila yung play for that. Arboleda ngayon. O, parado lahat ng papasahan. Oh, good move by Med Salim. Oh, pero no. Billy Robles. sa ang galing yun? Wow! Nandun pa sa kabilang hash mark. Rumi cover dropping down at inabot yung layup ni Med Salim. Supalpal. Billy Robles coming up big on the defensive side of the basketball. Puso baka mong pinag-uusapan. You, you know, uh, maraming player, they talk about it. 
tapon but katawan eh. Billy Robles on a re what what looks what looked like a defensive breakdown. Good fake handoff by Med Salim. Eh, tulad nga rin sinabi mo, coming out of nowhere to si Billy Robles. Bigla na lang sumulpot eh. 